What's up, boys? It's Rowdy here. I haven't made a NASCAR 21 video because I don't know what to say about the game because I don't know anything about it. I've not been following a lot of the news. I have watched all the Dev Diary stuff like that. And I've been sort of nervous. I haven't really, like, posted my thoughts on it. I've been a little bit nervous about making my thoughts on it. Um, because I was super hype about Heat Evolution when it first came out. And since this is a new company making the game, don't want to be like that again. and be like, hey, everyone should get this game. Um, so I've just been waiting for like legit gameplay to come out and we have some from the Dega demo. Uh, Sloppy Joe uploaded his links in the description. If you want to watch his video, he's more in depth and everything than I will be. Uh, but there is something in this video that I do not like, and I already saw it, and I I don't know if it's going to get fixed before the game comes out. I know the game comes out in, like, what, two weeks? Three weeks, maybe? It comes out in October. Um, yeah, there's something I just did not like what I saw, and I'm going to play that clip for you right now. Derek Amaral will get hit, and as his car is settling, watch Joey Logano hit the number 10 car. Did you notice the physics right there? Let's slow it down for a second. When Eric Almarola and Joey Logano make contact, it shoots the 10 car back up into the 52. And as you can tell, the cars really react in the way it would in real life. So if you ask me, the physics so far got an A plus in my book when it comes to the wreck physics. All right, so you saw that the wreck looks cool and everything. You see Almarola's car go up, but I want y'all to watch something else. Watch this 15 car. It's next to Almarola. That thing keeps bouncing. After the wreck, look, it's still bouncing, still bouncing, still bouncing, still bouncing. And then when the 52 gets hit, it kind of does the same thing. It bounces for a little bit. There's one bounce, two bounce, three bounce. The cars, like when they kind of catch a little air, they look really bouncy. And I mean, you heard what the man said in the video, A plus on the physics. That the 15s does not look realistic at all, in my honest opinion. Um, and that's something I'm scared about, because that does not look good at all. Watching that 15 car just bounce, bounce, bounce in a weird angle. It does not make that look great at all. 